was one. I borrowed Putty's car and all the presets on his radio were Christian rock stations. I like Christian rock. It's very positive. It's not like those real musicians who think they're so cool and hip. So, you think that Putty actually believes in something? I mean, it's, it's a used car. He probably never changed the presets. Yes, he is lazy. Plus, he probably doesn't even know how to program the buttons. Yes, he is dumb. So you prefer dumb and lazy to religious? Dumb and lazy, I understand. <laughs> Tell you how you could check. Huh. Reprogram all the buttons, see if he changes them back. You know, the old switcheroo. No, no, the old switcheroo is you poison your drink and then you switch it with the other person. <laughs> No, it's doing the same thing to someone that they did to you. Yeah, Elaine's gonna do the same thing to Putty's radio that the radio did to her. Well, that's the gist of it. Quiet! <laughs> Hello, boys. Hey, so did you get that radio, the old switcheroo? I did. Mm hmm? And the Christian rock? Resurrected. <laughs> and look what I pried off of his bumper. A Jesus fish! <laughs> Do you have any fish sticks? No. So you're disappointed he's a spiritual person? Well, yeah, I got him because he seems so one-dimensional. I feel misled. I think it's neat. You don't hear that much about God anymore. I hear things. So where do you want to eat? Feels like an Arby's night. Do you believe in God? Yes. Oh, so you're pretty religious. That's right. So is it a problem that I'm not really religious? Not for me. Why not? I'm not the one going to hell. Well, I'm going to hell. That seems about right. According to Putty. Hey, have you heard the one about the guy in hell with the coffee and the donuts? I'm not the... in the mood. I'll have some coffee and a donut. <laughs> what do you care? You don't believe in hell. I know, but he does. So it's more of a relationship problem than the final destination of your soul. Well, relationships are very important to me. Hmm. Maybe you can strike one up with the Prince of Darkness as you burn for all eternity. <laughs> and a slice of devil's food cake. Lane, they forgot to deliver your paper today. Why don't you uh, just grab that one? Th that belongs to Mr. Potato Guy. That's his. Come on, I get it. <laughs> well, if you want it, you get it. Sorry, thou shalt not steal. <laughs> oh, but it's okay for me. Oh, what do you care? You know where you're going. <laughs> All right, that is it. I can't live like this. Oh, no. Come on. All right, what did I do? David, I'm going to hell. The worst place in the world. With devils and those, those caves and, and the ragged clothing. It's gonna be rough. <laughs> you should be trying to save me. Don't boss me. This is why you're going to hell. I am not going to hell. And if you think I'm going to hell, you should care that I'm going to hell, even though I am not. You stole my Jesus fish, didn't you? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Let me see if I understand this. You're concerned that he isn't concerned that you're going to hell, and you feel that she's too bossy. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's right. right. Well, oftentimes in cases of interfaith marriages, couples have difficulty. Whoa, 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 whoa. No one's getting married here. You aren't? No. Oh. We're just, you know, having a good time. <laughs> Well, then it's simple. You're both going to hell. No way, this is bogus, man. Well, thank you, Father. Oh, 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 did you hear the one about the new guy in hell who's talking to the devil by the coffee machine? Really not in the mood. I'm going to hell. Ah, lighten up. It'll only feel like an eternity. <laughs> 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 